<sighs> oh, dwarf hunter. Is Wait, what, what's point? back here? Like behind it, behind the cave. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, there should be some spawns up here. Westy says <gasps> there is. There we go. It's here the whole time. Let's <laughs> GTFO. Oh. Recipe pork ribs. Mm, thank you very much. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> minor. Oh. Did you say pork ribs? Level three mage died. These last words were this time. It's personal. <laughs> Hero. I just oh, made my wand. Grats. Oh yeah. Thank you. Now make a hundred more for us. Right. Hurry quick. Yes, yes. <laughs> I would have got it a lot sooner Didn't too if I wasn't on dummy. If it wasn't for those meddling kids. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Shit just got and I have a staff I can train here. Fuck yeah. We rollin'. Mm -hmm. Oh, gotta get we here. Can finally play the game. My final verdict from the Wowhead comments on the uh, lesser magic one is that taking the leather working route is a little bit faster, like you can get your wand earlier, but I don't think it's as efficient as you miss out on getting like a robe and making bags and mm. shit. I think I would have probably gotten the wand a little sooner in levels, but I was a dummy and I forgot that mail takes an hour in classic WoW. Yeah, even when it's to an Ouch. hour, it's pretty Yeah, sick. I mailed a bunch of mats to my bank vault because I was like, well, if I die, I don't want to fucking lose all this progress as far as, you know, getting all this leather and shit, and then when I sent it back and I was ready, I was like, shit! Yep. <laughs> it takes a fucking hour, so I just had to spend the rest of that time leveling. A you gotta play 4D chess. Yeah. So, it, it definitely, like the Wowhead comment says, it's a way to get your wand a little bit earlier, but then you kind of miss out on a robe and um, bags and stuff, so I don't know. There's no way we do the follow-up here, right? The bow and snappers and shamans? Do we do it? Oh <laughs> my god. Ooh, I don't think is, so. Is anybody a le no. above level 7 that's playing a level no. another wearing class that wants a free green chest item? May hear it free in the tune change. Level changed. 7, sure. <laughs> <laughs> free, you say? Yeah, you said free? Yeah, because otherwise I'm just gonna probably, I don't know, maybe sell them on the auction house. I'm not really sure if they're gonna sell Mail them. Mail it to no fun. So you're, we're going Iron Forge, right? <sighs> yeah, I probably should. Mail it to who? No fun. One word. No fun. No yep. fun. Okay. You're gonna out-level yeah, up by the time it arrives? Awesome. No, I'm gonna stop for like 15 minutes to smoke weed. <laughs> Yo, that's a long <laughs> session, brother. I mean, yeah. Well, it's because I'm casting need to fade in real life. Give him a and second. Roll a joint and then <laughs> smoke it. So like. Oh yeah, you gotta enjoy that. Yeah. yeah. Does anybody else want a like above level seven green leather chest piece? Anybody else need? You do get a. Yeah, Hogger gives you a good one if you. Uh. uh I will definitely. I would take one. Not I got not okay. touching him. So it's no fun, capital N O F U N. Yep. Okay. Yep. No fun. An O okay. to the first nine levels of the fucking dwarf hunter. <laughs> and what's the other one? Somebody else wanted one? Oh, uh, Teddy san. It's, uh, Teddy, T E T D I E. And then S S A N. So Teddy song, that's so cute. Uh, capital T E D D I E S A N. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, honestly, appreciate it. 
No problem. I made some extra because the wowhead comment didn't seem like he was converting the right numbers for the light lover. So I was like, I don't want to fucking drop um, tailoring and not have enough. So I made some extra. Makes sense. I think I'm taking tailoring anyway. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go engineering after Never this. experienced with the, t- the crafting system in this game. I definitely think engineering is best, so. Yeah, yeah it, um, like the Icy Veins guy that Rix made, um, he was saying why engineering was so good for Warlocks. Well, I think for really any class, but Warlocks especially. It excels on any class that has bad mechanism. Like yeah, the your needs, the gl- goggles, and uh, like training dummies and shit. So yeah, yeah, I the training dummies can bro. save your life, and then the uh, the rockets and bombs. The grenades are so good. Pulling, thing? yeah. Which, ironically enough, I think engineering is the one perfect.
Okay, you said something about pets and then spells. Warlock pets. The orc passive pet right. increase damage. Uh, it he wants to know if it applies to the Watch your back. Alright, cool, so that means firebolt's stronger. That's all I wanted to know. It's just a little confusing when you're like, pet spell like your spell? No, my little retarded imp. It just hops all day. Uh, I'm curious if it increases the the Voidwalker's torment ability and increased threat. Oh oh Voidwalker threat is a lie. People are selling the Greater Magic Wand for 58 silver. <laughs> oh Fucking gosh. scalpers, man. Dude, that just makes me one up. I'm gonna be making some wands. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Start grinding. Bro. Looking for something specific? I guess I'll just buy it. as hunter can't even beat a little right bear. See you around. There's not enough skinners in Lock like Madon because my bags have 140 light leather. It's a lot of beasts in Lock Madon, too. Yeah, just, there's just dead, skinnable corpses everywhere. I haven't seen anyone skinning besides me. Oh, I ran across. Okay, I'm gonna buy a lesser magic wand for now. Yeah, how much are you paying? 12 silver. Nice. <clears throat> One of my goals tonight. Get that while the getting's good. Level 13! Grab your tank, but let it. Oh, it's 15. How are these people dying at level 1? Like, what are you doing? Probably doing it on purpose, I guess. Not all. I feel like I should have done that immediately. That. Like, get that first one out of the way. <laughs> Kill the first mob and get a bag. Be like, fair. I'll just kill myself now. I get it. Hey, guess what? Now I have level two fortitude, so plus eight stamina. Yeah. Oh shit! <laughs> Are you? Let me uh, send some mail. Are you good to go to wetlands? I was gonna go to Stormwind. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. We can do that. Yeah. Let's hit the tram. Super quick, sorry. Where are you and going? Then, where, are you, where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, is this not? Oh shit! Hall of Arms. Whoops. I can learn swords while we're there. I'll need it anyway. So. Big levels. I'll have a lot more uh, survivability and healing after this. I'll have to uh, check myself to not be overconfident, but desperate prayer will be a nice. Oh yeah. shit, button for us. Make sure you have uh, that thing clicked off so you can wand without it making you auto attack too. There's something in the settings. Oh, I think that's oh, I always... been removed. Oh, it's I got removed? I just select wand. Okay, if I just click Rams here. Yeah, because I, I was trying to find that setting earlier and I couldn't. Yeah, I, I just have uh, the shoot command, and I just use that. Far right. The alt-right. You gotta use the alt-right boat. Yeah. You know, honestly, I've been playing uh, Baldur's Gate way too much. My initial yeah. reaction when we got on this was to push you off it. Oh my god. <laughs> Toxic. <laughs> Can you die if you fall off the tram? No, but you're gonna be fucking stuck. And then long it's gonna run. suck. It is a very long run. <laughs> you could just kill yourself and just res at the, uh, just take res sickness. <laughs> I mean, I probably, probably wouldn't do that, but... Because you're not a real gamer? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
I'm getting so many fucking patterns drop, it's ridiculous. Y'all ain't ready for Yolf, Defender of the Deep, Protector of the Realm. Where? We're here. I know I'm AFK, did I? Oh no. Oh, just start going back. Can I jump off and be fine? Yeah, 100%. Know. Should be fine. <laughs> Should be. I, I Famous could make, last so. words. Yeah, I'm just gonna write it again. I'm making coffee anyways. Do what you gotta do. Understood. Ooh, level 15 warrior just ripped. Mm. Who was the highest is level out there? The last somebody was saying it was like 19, but it's probably like, yeah, 20 something. 21 maybe? Yeah, I see. Uh, 20 level 20 in the, on the horde side. Some fucking hunter, probably. Rogue, I bet. I wish yeah. I was a little bit higher level so I could, uh. Because honestly, we're getting close to the level where we can start doing some dungeons. Yeah. Dead mines before yeah, we the, sleep. Uh, highest tune on the horde side is actually a rogue as well. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I don't that... know why that surprises me, I guess. Damn, people are selling. Man, whoever created the first... You can't tell me on both sides that the whoever created the first characters who's top in the lead is gonna... They're gonna one-shot this. I mean, they had some practice, probably. So who knows? I mean, everyone's known about the official servers for a while now. It wouldn't be hard to practice run it, like, a hundred times. Just keep doing it until you fucking survive. The thing is, is that this game is still at the core of it and how it functions an RNG-based game. So at some point, at near the end of the lowest, highest levels, these people would have to experience some form of bad RNG that could fuck their run. Yes, yeah, 100%. But, some, but some classes have so many escapes that like as long as you... literally has... Yeah, as long as you I mean, always... don't get me wrong, you can get bad luck with Vanish, but Vanish is pretty fucking, pretty good. Well, the, the, the only, well, the thing that every rogue will have is fucking, what you call it, is some form of, um, they're gonna have some form of, like, weapon swing timer, because that's the only way they get fucked up with Vanish. Because mm -hmm. it's, it's basically making sure you time your vanish away from the auto-attack of an enemy. Because it's basically, if you vanish right when an enemy auto-attacks, you they will hit you and they will hit you out of vanish. Yeah, 100%. Smaller batching is nice for that, but at least well it can't be resisted like people used to think. Which is, which is why I know that the main uh, path for vanishing for most rogues is you're not even supposed to be your starter thing. It's usually you're supposed to hit sprint, innovation, run away from something, and then vanish. So you're not near anything when you once you vanish. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I've heard as well. You do need white leather. Yeah. Uh. I'm gonna train Steve's while I'm here. This is so stupid. Right here. Whoever's watching my stream, understand my pain. Why can't I run over this? I will die on this hill. Like the spot on the other side that you can't jump over. Frustrating. Yeah, why is um? I just got my warrior. I got my rogue. All I know that's the hilarious to me is is fucking is if if I go over my distance with my warrior, because his name is fucking retarded. His name is actually retarded, or like you no. just think it is retarded? It's a stupid <laughs> name. He is Yolf, okay. defend. He is Yolf, defender of the deep, protector of the realm. I was gonna say, I don't think that uh, name is gonna last to sixty before you get there. Uh, probably not. I mean, literally in the name, I, that is that is the comment I'm making back towards people. What do you think Yolf means? It's an acronym. No idea. 
Ye of little faith. <laughs> Man, I hate. I can't. You know, why can't I do that in the settings? I hate that I always have to turn auto loop back on. It's it's pretty shit. I. Man's out here already got a better shield. Oh, well, I'm. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. Well, well, the only honest danger I would say is that outside of like major practice, the main thing with these people going extreme is the one danger on that is that no matter how much practice is, if you're trying to go go into like, I need to be the top fucking leveler on the on this on these servers, and then you're like they're up there now, but they're like sleep deprived. That will affect their gameplay. Oh, All right. So. Uh, tram back. Yeah, I'm just very quickly grabbing some tailoring supplies. Yeah, I, I'm sure like they got like sleep scheduled out, so I'm sure that whoever's like the highest right now is probably gonna log off like pretty soon, like one to two hours uh, more, and then they're gonna log off, and then they're gonna make sure they get like back on like nah, like six hours later. Go until tomorrow night. Anything yeah. less than that, they're not. The guy who gets first is probably going to stay awake for 50 hours straight. Like, if Joker didn't die, the man probably would have stayed up for 48. Uh, the I didn't have to go to work tonight. The line I of would, be would be like, all right, bro, dude, let's go. Their account sharing. Like, you, you underestimate how much the very first level 60 hardcore means to somebody. People will push their body to the absolute limit to be the first. That doesn't uh, matter. You're, that that will, right back. going into a healthy mindset you. to do will affect your gameplay. Yeah, it will. I mean, yeah, there was people account sharing for like High Warlord back in the day, so there's definitely going to be people account sharing it, it, for this. Yeah. Well, my main thing is that I definitely feel that if uh, if they if you feel like someone like that is going to push like 50 hours because they're that intense, I'm pretty sure that person will die. There is some point where they're just going to be slow. Sleep fatigue, they won't be able to like figure out a scenario, I guess. Like, no, I, I think we're gonna see level 60s by Sunday. No, it's your that, that I agree with. Yeah, I'm yeah, not I... saying it won't be a short time period for when we see 60s, but I'm saying like the dudes who are probably who are probably, in my opinion, are gonna get it. it's not the ones who are going extreme about it and like staying up 48 hours. I think it's the ones who are like smart and they're like, okay, I'm already level 25 now today. Let me sleep for like a good six hours, get back on, and now I'm gonna be like level forty by the next day. No, there's gonna there's gonna be at least one guy that just chats it out and makes it. Whereas, I'm yeah, sure six, six, six to four I'm hours. Sure some of them will die, but there's gonna be one guy that's oh, gonna be like fifty hours and it makes it. If anyone wants yeah, to make some money flipping, Malachites and Tiger's Eye are on the auction house for basically vendor price. They should just go up, right? <laughs> They're only 15c on the on the auction house. Uh, yeah, some of them are posted for like 10c bid and then like 20 buyout. But the tiger's eyes are posted for like on your one mind? silver, 10 copper, which bid vendors for one silver anyways. So. But know. maybe 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 the bottleneck won't be too bad and it's a waste of money. I don't know. My bags are full and I just had to make a decision: do I delete something for this malachite? Nope. No, you're not saying it right. Yeah, if you, uh, if you like, buy him now and film at like prime time tomorrow, you'll probably probably make a little bit. I I went to the auction to try to get it, the... selling the Mal Malachite that I got, and fucking when I went in there, everyone's selling it for like less than a silver. So I'm at the tram, by the way, Kale. Yeah. We... All the all the low level stuff is gonna be pretty cheap. Rams here. What can I do for I you? Am, uh, you know what? I got an idea. I'm gonna. You got my attention. You gotta save your hearth. Yeah, I, no, I was gonna hurt, but it just takes me to the wrong place. Never said that. We're going uh, wetlands to. Well, I guess you could hearth. 
if you have it in iron punch. I don't. I have one. So wait, wait, we're going to wetlands? Yeah, wetlands. Shit. Wait, you sure? Are we gonna do... Have you already done hogger? Mm-hmm. And all that? Bruh, I'm sure, like, the first fucking high-level warrior that's up there has a warrior fucking did hogger with the fucking fence post trap. Nope, there we go. Mage goes down to Son of Aragal. I don't need ruined leather scrap for anything, do I? We can vendor that. Well, isn't there a, there an add-on just straight up called death log so you can just see who everyone's yep. dying? Um, do you have yeah. leather working? I got, I got the death log add-on because there's no point yeah, having a hardcore add-on in my eyes. I think you can yeah. turn the ruined leather scraps into light leather. Okay. What is it called? Copy that. I'm back now, Kale. If you were, I, I would assume that it's just literally straight up called death log. Yeah, it, it's just called death log. There's I'm on my way. If you have iron, iron no, I have skinning and tailoring. No, oh, I okay. don't. Seven. Should a hunter the, have yeah, leather you working instead? What's your hearth right now? It's uh, the what place class under are you? A hunter. So I'm at. Karos. I would probably Karos. have. You, you can go there and we can do the wetland skip. Yeah. Mountain yeah. Thing. Leatherworking is not bad for a hunter, but right. all the guys are gonna be like, "Oh no, engineering." Isn't wetlands like level twenty? Well, we're going to wetlands to take the boat <laughs> over to yeah, engineering. Uh, what's it called? Leatherworking. You can make a pretty good ammo pouch. I can't remember what, what level it is. What yeah. is our XP tell? It's do? it's very early on. It's like yeah. uh, level twenty five in leatherworking that you can make that pouch. Yeah. I think it has or me 30. doing. All the stuff in uh, Stormwind. You can also make the Defias leather belt, Storm which is wind. a sick belt. Yeah, it like Stormwind, yeah. killing the Kobold guys. Yeah, and as then, a hunter, yeah. can I make most of my gear if I take leatherworking? Yes. Yeah. Uh, cause, uh, especially because leatherworking gets better for hunters. Than, it's actually better for yeah. hunters than it even is for rogues. Because near the end, leatherworking becomes male working, which is like your guys' best armor. Yeah. 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 You the, haven't done the whole the... thing with engineering, though, is it just gives so much utility and yeah. hardcore. Everyone's just gonna say, "Oh no, engineering's the best." Right. Show it. me on your your stream. I'm on stream. Goldshire. Oh, you haven't done all the Goldshire stuff. I see. Yeah. We don't have to do it. You're a little over leveled for it, anyways. If that makes you feel any better. Um. You're what, like 14 now? Ah, uh, well. I'm 12. Uh, so the wetland skip is down like here. Jun Jungle Kelly has defeated Scraggy in a duel. But what? was it a duel to the death? The zone we're going to is like level 12. And it's like the most packed quest zone, so. Okay, I'll probably just skip all these then. I kind of wish they would have, uh, like, removed regular duels. We can do Hogger, like, once we're done, because we go back that way, I think. Will the item from Hogger even be relevant, then? Not sure. I think it's a staff, anyways. But, I don't know, up to you, man. I'll be chilling, if I did all that solo, I guess, but... Yeah, currently I'm not even too worried about these quests. I'm probably just gonna not care. No. I wish I could just snap pause it. Or you can skip ahead to tell yourself. Mm, see people trying to pug skull uh, rock quest, that's amusing. Get yourself oh, interesting. Um they don't have one. What it's the Dark Shore, fuck? Because they have us do Westfall into Dark Shore. Yeah. Interesting. I mean, we could. Uh, this one's just super dense, and then you still have all the Westfall stuff right after it. I get you. We'll, uh, we'll just do that. I have no problems with that. I'm just happy to be playing with somebody. It's a good time. Uh, that's, a, that's the fun part. That's what I knew that everyone that everyone was like. Goddamn We're fuck the add-on. We just wanted to play together while also having a chance to die. Exactly. Yeah, We're I just doing like the thing. play on a fresh server and actually use the uh, market. Yes. It was just 
Well, the main problem was it was just sad that most of the time beforehand, fucking, the people who originally came up with this concept were fucking over here. Those, actually. those who thought you, know, you here, in order no, no, to no, prove back, you're back, good, back. you gotta, you gotta be self-found. Mm -hmm. Right here. I think the main thing was they didn't want the. Uh, this is the tricky jump spot right here. The, like Make the sure non hardcore, sure, like right like, here. Community like. And helping out the hardcore community and then saying, oh yeah, no, they helped me out, like, I got all the way You gotta redo it? Shit like that. Yeah, I gotta agree on you on that part, but it's just that whole, for me, it's the whole fact that a, a tr them trying to market it that that's true hardcore, and it's like, no, every other video game we know that hardcore is just, you, you can play within the limits of the game, like, you have everything Fuck. to the game's disposal, you just can't die. Like, true hardcore isn't, like, harder than normal. Oh, right, I got, got it. it. You got it. Hell yeah. I mean, that's why, like, as soon as this was coming out, I was like, I'm, I'm not going to use the add-on because there's no fucking point. Like, I could give a shit less about achievements on an add-on. How do you unlearn a profession? All right, that's the you hardest You just go right into there. your character, you go into you the go to, skills You go to tab. skills, and if you go to the end of it, there's going to be, like, a yeah. little, like, circle with a slash through it. You click that. Well, you, you, ho you will hover, essentially, over the skill, and you'll see that circle. Yeah. Slip, drop, me yeah. die. <laughs> Don't yeah, do it. Basically, if you the here's how it works. Basically, if you want more reliability, like if you feel like you're gonna get into a lot of dungeon groups and dungeon grind a whole lot in different points in your run. It's better to do a profession that gets you, like, better armors, or better weapons, or boosts, like in dungeons like alchemy, and herbalism, or or your gear, so, like, black So, hover over tailoring in the skill, in the spell book. That's what oh, well, what, what, well, what, 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 no, no, skill. No, press, so, press C, go to skill, and then you'll yeah. see, uh... Yeah, you have to, you have to yeah, go to skill. Literally and then you click on it. Okay. I think and it's you this way. Yep, I see it. Yeah. Tailoring, unlearn. Yeah. Beautiful. But basically, if you're more of a dungeon person, then yeah, then you would go like with tailoring as well or in enchanting. But if you're like gonna do this where it's similar to a south found where you are mostly questing your way up. Yeah. Then you should do fucking. It is better to do mining, engineering, and then just make everything you need. Uh, Leatherworking is also and skinning is also pretty good in dungeons. <laughs> yeah, I like, intend on uh, doing dungeons. Like when I had my uh, hunter, that was.